have uh, interstate uh, conflicts in Africa, but uh, poverty and anger is also a crisis. Natural disaster is also, it, has, it comes with a lot of challenges. Climate change effects, I'm not sure if we are affected uh, equally, globally. So it's, uh, now the challenge is uh, aligning. First and foremost is make sure that uh, you, the basic needs for your people are catered for. That is very important. And then now you go beyond and see how do you address these challenges. Um, the beauty about Africa, we belong in different configuration. We have a, a, a number of original communities. So we work together because you cannot address them individually as a nation. And then uh, now from there, you go to the African Union. But again, you address them collectively as um, from a matrato point of view. So the alignment is not as easy and straightforward as one would think, mm. because there are a number of factors and consideration which you take into consideration when you, tr you try to align. How can we improve that? Improving is um, uh, to enhance first, if, you talk, uh, if we are looking at a crisis, is to improve uh, your resilience, because that is very critical. But also it is to improve, as it was said, partnership with other, other countries, but also with other communities. And then uh, I, I was uh, listening to the opening remarks when, he, when there was a mention that uh, Germany is also trying to enhance their defense capabilities. It is amazing because uh, we look and we feel that they are very advanced. For us now, that is what we are trying to do to enhance our economic capabilities, but not leaving alone our military capabilities as well. So what to do is not again, is not a, you cannot have a straightforward answer, mm. because there are a number of things which you need to do um, by balancing, but also by taking uh, these um, um, plans a step by, you have to use a step by step approach.